Last time on Pokemon Forest Sky, we challenged the seventh gym leader who strongly resembles Professor Juniper. A Samurai thought it'd be fun to kill poor Helipop in his very first battle, and then surprised me with Hydro Cannon annihilating Storm in the process. After we beat her, Juniper, I mean Aragai, orders us to go fix her lab. Sky decides to challenge us to a battle, which he only seems to do when we have work to do. Are we sure he isn't actually the antagonist in this game? We fix Aragai's lab, but then I get lost and ran to all Brussels sprouts. Sky informs us that we have to go fight Team Aqua in Peel City, because somehow I got drafted into the Poke Avengers. That was last time, what will happen today? Let's find out! What's going on guys, Yang with Heart Attack, and welcome back to Pokemon Forest Guy, the Nuzlocke run. With the face cam. Uh, by popular demand, everybody, almost everybody seemed to like the face cam. Um, which is awesome. I'm really glad you guys like this new change. You didn't like see me and go like, Oh my god, what is that? Take it away! That was appreciated. So, I think there was very few co people that actually um, disapproved of it. I know there was one person that said, um only to do it on special occasions and not to overdo it like PewDiePie, which I don't watch PewDiePie so I'm assuming he does face cams a lot. And um, I'm not really sure what would be categorized as a special occasion, so yeah, but I'd say like 98.4% of people liked it, so we're going to be keeping it up. Anyways, today we got to go in this museum, and I actually don't remember like, anything of what's supposed to be going on here, but all I know is like we're supposed to come to the museum and we'll go from there. So. <laughs> Uh, I'm the curator of this museum of fine arts. It's the heartening, it's heartening, yeah, that's a word, to see someone so young as you in the museum. Have you viewed our collections of painting? Yeah, sure, totally. Oh, I do believe that you seem to be a Pokemon trainer. Have you an interest in paintings? Yeah, I, I paint some things, I guess not really. Oh, excellent, you do like paintings. Then may I ask you to come with me? Oh god, no. Why, why does all the old people take an interest in me? This is our special exhibit hall. Uh, it's some nice paintings you've got there, sir. I don't wish to exhibit works of so-called classic art. So classical works you can see on ground floor. I wish to exhibit work that is far different from the classics. Art, after all, is not restricted for the old. In this exhibit hall I wish to fill it with modern and vibrant artworks of Pokemon seemingly ready to spring forth into glorious life. I beg your pardon, I didn't intend to monopolize the conversation. Now, I like Monopoly. That's a fun game. I always like to play as a dog. I think there's a dog in Monopoly. Or the hippo? That's hungry, hungry hippos. That's a fun game too. I like, I like eating. That's fun. You must encounter a lively Pokemon that works of art depicting them. And if you were, what does this have to do with the story at all? Um, I thought we were supposed to come here, and it was like, oh, okay, here we go. We got an aqua grunt. I was like, man, this is so confusing. Why does the old guy like not notice this grunt here? Oh, wait, whoa, what? What's going on? Huh? I remember you. That kid who broke our plans. I'll punish you, dude. No, we can't battle in here. This is a museum. That's so rude. No, no, I don't. Did I use the Pokemon Center? I don't remember if I went to the Pokemon Center. I did! Okay, good, so... Ooh, freaking flinch axe, awesome. Um, I originally wasn't gonna make a video today, because I was having a relatively bad day, and I was feeling all sour, and I didn't want to do anything, but... Um, I ended up, like, watching some YouTube videos, and I, like, legitimately... I was watching, um... Star, who's a TF... who makes TF2 videos, so a lot of you probably don't know who he is, but... I was watching a video that he made today that was called, like, Jermos Mad Part 3. And I legitimately, like, legitimately started, like, just constantly laughing out loud. It was a very, very funny video. And, um, wait a minute. This is Tate and Lisa's gym puzzle thing, isn't it? In Ruby and Sapphire? What the heck? What? Is this? What is this doing here? <gasps> it's a conspiracy! Oh, crap. What? I don't know what. Can I? Can I catch this? <laughs> um... Uh, I, I guess I can catch it. I, wow. <laughs> Why? Oh, uh, we poisoned it. That's not good. All right, so this is probably like our only chance to catch it, actually. Um, yeah, you know, I won't turn down an electrode. I could use an electric type, I guess. Awesome. Cool. Um, what are we gonna nickname you? I'm gonna nickname you. Uh, I was gonna nick it. Oh, I was gonna nickname him Pokeball because he looks like a Pokeball, but instead I'm gonna go with Apricorn because that's what Pokeballs were like originally made of or whatever. So, Ape. That's already spelling it wrong. Apricorn. Apri. Or is that. 
Yeah, that's apricorn. The one confused, um, in fourth gen, like when you're doing a little quiz to get the little device thing that I don't remember, or whatever you're supposed to be doing, the app for the radio, I think. <laughs> this is making no sense. Um, when you're doing that, and like the question of this, woo, does Kurt make uh, Pokeballs out of apricots? I always got confused because I never, I never realized he made it out of apricorns. I always thought it was just like apricots, and I'm like, why is the answer to that no? I'm so confused. But turns out Hardy's just, he's not very smart. So we have to go back this way. I actually like this puzzle. Um, I don't like the emerald puzzle for Tate and Lisa, but that's just because I don't like tile mazes. I think they're really just annoying and stupid. Don't you blow up on me, please. Why does it seem like some electrodes, they're very suicidal, and others are just really dumb, and I try to use nothing with spark. I don't understand you. Um, am I going the right way? I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm lost. I was just bragging about how I like this puzzle, and now I'm lost, and I have no idea. Oh, okay, I think I did something right. Oh, oh, no, no, I was, he's right there. And, all right, so let's kill yet another electrode. I don't know why they have electrodes here, but, um, what is electrodes? You want to think they'd want electrodes where Team Aqua is. I mean, they're, like, known for their water-type Pokemon, but... Maybe I'm just, maybe they, well, I don't know if they, yeah, I pressed the button. I don't know if they put the electrodes there. Now, you see, this is going to start a big conspiracy of, did the, the Team Aqua turn on their own kind and put electrodes in the building? Or were they attacked by electrodes? Or did they just avoid the electrodes? And how did they get here without pressing the buttons if the electrodes are in the buttons? So many unanswered questions. Oh, you're my second trick. Hee hee. You're on my second trick. Hee hee. I, I, I just want to know how you got here. That is a very impressive trick. I mean, I, it confused me, so was that the... This is the same trainer as last time. He didn't even change his Pokemon. He had a, yeah, okay, this is literally the exact same battle we did, and he's going to have a Corsola next, so... Why are we doing this? This, this is just like... We're going to make a lot of Heart, Gold, and Soul Silver references today, because this is just like in the Rocket Headquarters, where you have to battle the same guys over and over and over and over whenever you walk by the stupid statue, which is really incredibly, like, stupid, because... They're only like level 20 too, they're not even difficult for like the 7th, you're at the 7th gym in the game by that point, so they should be more difficult, but whatever. The game has only just begun, hee hee hee, bye kid! Wait, okay, well, ooh, which one am I supposed to go on? Right, should I follow him? Or should I, this seems like a trick. Um, yeah, I don't like these decisions, um, okay, we're gonna go this one. Ah! Oh, the, no! Oh my god, I gotta do the puzzle. I gotta do the puzzle again. Why? 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 What did I do to deserve this? I don't want to do this stupid puzzle on it. Why can't you just die? Why can't you just die? I don't want to do this again. It's just, just no. Just, just no. Alright, note to self. Uh, the Aqua Grunts probably are not smart enough to play tricks on us, so we should have really just followed him. Ooh, where are we? Aqua Hideout. Okay, last time we were in Magma Hideout, so this is a new place. So if we find a Pokemon here, we can actually... Oh! Okay. I guess we don't have to battle you. We can actually catch it if... Do you, do you battle us? What, what's your story? I designed this space, man. There are traps that can find the intruders like you! Okay, so... But you don't battle, so can I potentially just, like, threaten to punch you in the face and force you to tell me where to go? Yeah. You didn't think about that one, did you? There's loopholes in your little strategy for trap things. Mmm. Yeah. You didn't, you're not going to like this. Ooh, Kingdra, or a Muck. What should I do against a Muck? I should probably train Shino. Just because she's just, or, yeah, it is a girl. She's just kind of, like, sitting here behind doing nothing. What in the world? I just realized, like, Muck. Oh, my God. <laughs> I told you my Kingdra. <laughs> that is horrifying, his face. I don't know what's wrong with... Wow, you have two Hyper Potions? I don't know what is wrong with like all the- Whoa! Oh crap, body slam did a lot, body slam did a lot. No, 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 no! Okay, maybe this should stop using the speed button so much. Wow, that's doing a lot of damage. And I got confused. Okay, let's switch into Felipe, my special wall. Well, I just realized this really crap special physical defense, so hopefully this wasn't a bad idea. Let's- not even gonna risk it, let's use Surf to kill you. And, okay, maybe we shouldn't be battling the trainers in this place. They're a the scientist, man. He's like, came to avenge his scientist brother that I was insulting. So, 
Every time I insult someone, they try to kill my Pokemon. I don't know why people have to be so rude. I It's like, what did I... This looks exactly like the Magma Hideout. Like, I think it's the same pattern. So, maybe we'll be able to get through relative... Are you the... Oh my god, it's you again! Why? Why won't you just leave me alone? Why, why are you doing this to me? Do you think I want to battle you like 60,000 times? No, I don't. I particularly don't even like you that much. I think you smell bad. But I was just trying to let it go. I was just going to let you go. I wasn't going to say anything. I wasn't going to try to hurt your feelings. But it just... You got you to gotta make life difficult. So let's put Shino up front. Um, just for the heck of it. Might as well at least try training her. And at least I guess since it's like the same pattern as last time. It should be relatively easy to get through this time. So I guess... I can't complain about that. And let's rock slide, hopefully, maybe kill. Wow, okay, not kill you. That's cool, too. Um, I just realized Signal Beam is more powerful than Rock Slide because it has a higher base power. So maybe I should be using Signal Beam because it is stab and it is physical. So if both are neutral, Signal Beam is always going to do more damage. And I think Signal Beam has a chance to confuse. Um, I know it doesn't 4th generation, because I always gave signal, signal Beam to my Ampharos, and it would confuse things. Like, the first time it confused something, I was so confused. Because it confused me somehow, because I didn't, I didn't know it could do that. And so, in turn, it confusing me, confused, or confusing the Pokemon confused me, which I'm probably now confusing you, because I'm talking about confusing me, and I don't know who's more confusing right now, and this is a button, so... Oh, I remember this now. Okay, this isn't the same as Magma. I just... I remember this from the last time I played it because these switches confused me so much and I hate it all. But what I also hate is a track, but luckily we managed to get through that relatively. Why does everybody, are we are we playing Light Platinum accidentally? Because everybody here seems to have the exact same Pokemon and I don't like that. I don't like when everybody has, <laughs> stop having Corsolas. Do they just hand you guys these Pokemon and you're not allowed to pick your own? You're not allowed to have maybe individual. Ooh, that's doing a lot. That's doing a lot. That's doing a lot. Um, are you not allowed to have individuality or what? What's going on there? You guys, throw me in here. I'll I'll lend you guys some of my. Oh crap! There's two of them. Man, this is my own fault. I was ranting and raving about in the Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Hey, you have to face those two over and over and over. And now we're gonna have to end up doing that here. So I really jinxed myself this time. I. It is my fault. And, wow, speaking of confusion, we actually managed to do that. And let's paint a tactical eradicate. Hopefully you have an owl mom Oh, it's a you as well. Do all the girls just, like, share the same Pokemon? What is going on here? I don't... I didn't understand you guys' Pokemon logic. Alright, Beats, you got this right. Right? Right? Do you just Thunderbolt that thing, maybe? Ooh, I actually... I'm impressed with that amount of damage. I'm not going to complain that, um... We did a lot. Actually, I think in this game, um, fun little fact, Owl Momoa actually evolves from Love Disc. So, I don't know. I thought, okay. This is, um, what? <laughs> I don't even know what happened, but, uh, before this battle, I think, do I need to heal up? Yeah, Felipe definitely needs some HP, because I think we're going to have to do these two trainers yet again, which means we're going to have, yet again, the same Pokemon over and 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 over. Why do you... Uh, I was gonna say, why do you have a special attack? Now I realize Amnesia is not a special attack. So, my poor Subat, he never got any special attacks. He just got death. He didn't deserve it. He was a good Pokemon, but he was well. He wasn't a, a great Pokemon, obviously, because now he's dead because he didn't have any good freaking like psychic attacks. All he had is wing attack. Because how do you even? Who wants to get hit? But he's so adorable. It's like, oh, I'm hitting you with my little wings. <laughs> Just, aw, oh, man, who who would be mad at a Swoobat if they just came up to you and started, like, tapping you with their wings? I'd be like, oh, that's so adorable. I just want to hug you and, and love you because you're so amazing. So, I, I want a Swoobat now. Now that I'm thinking about this, one of you guys should send me a Swoobat. Yeah, just just go out, find a bat, draw a heart on its face, and then send it to me in the mail. And I would appreciate that. Please. That would be awesome. My birthday's coming up. That would be a wonderful present. Um, for those of you who my birthday is November 22nd, so it's, um, in, like, 13 plus a few days. Um, I don't know the number. Oh, wow, you get two moves at 30. What it, wait, what is the 22nd? Today's the 5th, so that would be 8, 17, yeah, 17 days. <laughs> it should not be this that difficult. I'm not good at math. I wanted to point that out right now. Has probably become very obvious by that horrible display. I'm not good at math. 
Uh, my birthday's in 17 days, so you guys should definitely send me a subat for my birth. Wow. This Awamomoa has some pretty intense AI, I gotta say. And it hits all five times, too. So, that's awesome as well. Um, I expect a lot of dead bats in my mailbox and a lot of birthday wishes on Skype. Just, I'm putting that pressure on you guys. You better get to it. Alright, where does this one go? This one goes there. This one goes... Alright, so we've been here. Where does this one go? Oh, we haven't been to this one yet. Alright, I don't remember how many switches there are. There's three or four, or... If we'll even... I don't know what happens when you hit all the switches. Does, like, the world explode? Because... If that's the case, I might not hit this last switch, because I kind of like the world. I don't know why, you know, it, it's never been the greatest thing in the world, but it's it's a relatively nice place, and I don't really have a lot of other options to live, so I gotta say, I'm kind of pulling for the world to survive, at least until I'm dead. I don't really care what happens after that. If you guys are still alive after I'm dead, then good luck, you know? I hope my death wish, my death wish of the world blowing up doesn't happen to you guys, because... If it does, I apologize. It's probably my fault. I put a bomb in the center of the earth, and the second that my heart stops beating, it will explode, and it will kill all of you. That's not true. That's not true. Please, FBI, don't come to my house and interrogate me, and definitely don't look under my bed. I promise it's not mine. I'm borrowing it from her. A friend is asking me to keep it safe. Yeah, because people totally do that, right? Right? Uh, yeah. Let's change the topic. I don't want. I want let's talk about something else. <gasps> I want to show you guys my pants. Or my short. Uh, I don't want to reverse the switch. I want to show you guys my shorts because I'm like really happy with what I'm wearing because I feel like a total badass. But then I'm like, you know what? Maybe that's not an okay to do thing to do is to like stand up and show my shorts to people because you guys may. What? Where do I even go? I'm so confused. I think I did. I hit all the buttons or what? I. That makes no sense. Alright, anyways, um, so, another thing, like I said, you know, I was saying earlier, I wasn't originally going to make a video today, but, like, watching a YouTube video put me in a really good mood, and I'm like, you know what, yeah, it could be fun, so, it was something else that put me in a really good mood today, and that's because I feel like a total badass for what I'm wearing right now, and I feel like, I feel very pretty because of it, and it's not very often I get a chance to feel pretty, so, um, I, I'm feeling really, like, pretty today, that's all I can say, it's just like, ooh. Oh, hey, this guy's Subat's actually decently high level. Does that... Ooh, let's heal Canada. Because I don't want him to die. And I'm out of bites. Crap. But that's alright. We'll just use physical... Side wave! Oh my god, you actually have a psychic time move. Okay, so apparently if I would have kept up with my Subat, he would have got side wave, which... Unfortunately, is also like the crappiest special... Or er, psychic move because it oh, never does the same amount of damage. So, um... Alright, really quickly, as you guys see, probably I'm just, like, wearing a basic black shirt, but, but, wait, wait for it. I have, I hope you can see a Sonic the Hedgehog shorts. Yeah. I'm awesome, not gonna lie. I got that as, like, a Christmas present last year. I don't know why, because overall, I'm not a really big Sonic person. I don't, okay, I know a lot of people probably hate me for saying this, because, like, there's probably, like, some Sonic fanboys here, but... I don't like the 2D Sonic games. I like the 3D Sonic games. I actually like Sonic Unleashed. I know a lot of people don't. I've never played Sonic 06, which apparently is like the worst game ever to be made. So I can't really comment on that. But I prefer the 3D Sonic games over 2D Sonic games. It's the same way that I prefer um, 3D Mario games over 3D... Oh, actually, that's probably not a good idea because it's Stuntfisk. Over the uh, 2D Mario games. Like, I like Mario Sunshine. I like... Super Mario 3D Land for 3DS is a very fun game. I like Mario 64. I just, I don't like 2D games very much, and I, I don't know why that is, but that's just, it's how my brain works, and I prefer 3D games. So, wow, wait, how did Surf do so little to Stun Fisk? What? Why? I'm really confused, like, why that did such a small amount. But you're now a normal type, so I can rock smash you. And, God, man, why is he so bulky? That is ridiculous. Has he always been that bulky? Stunfisk? I've no I don't think I've ever used a stunfisk before, but I always think they're water types for some reason. But um what did I just say about a submarine? I had on secret. Well, let's just say there's a submarine at the far end, but bye now. Uh Okay, I'm confused, but the music just I don't want to know what's up with that guy, he confuses me. The music just changed and it just got a lot more intense up in here. Oh crap. Alright, which one do we choose? I have a feeling. No, I was going to say I have a feeling we get a Master Ball here, but we already got the Master Ball, so... 
Uh, okay, we actually picked the right one, so I don't want to do that yet. I want to... Crap. Okay, I, that was my fault. Alright, so this one up here takes you back. Where does this one go? This one goes... I don't... I was going to say, I don't know if I trust that. I feel like I might have screwed myself over now, which makes me really sad. But is Kingdra's special attack just really crap? Because I feel like he should be doing more damage than he is. I know Kingdra's a physical attacker, but um, what is Kingdra's special attack stat even like? It is 96. That's, that's like the highest on my team. So he should be doing Meteor. Okay, can I go back? Okay, I can't go back. I just want to make sure I didn't get trapped somewhere. Um, I don't want to fight that. I don't really don't want to fight this scientist, and I'm trying to avoid him. And I'm messing up. Okay, what is this item? It's a freaking electrode. Really now? Oh, that wasn't necessary. Canada, your time ran out, man. You can only take so many explosions, I guess. Alright, I'm actually, like, legitimately sad, because Canada Canada got Broette status for life after that last explosion, and I guess that was just the last one that she had in her. I'm sorry, buddy. But, no! 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 I don't want to be back here! Okay, guys, I finally made it back. It took an extremely long time. Turns out I got really lucky the first time I went through here and I, like, picked all the right places. But along the way, it turns out there actually is another Master Ball. So take that for what you will. I'm not really sure what that means because I don't remember if there's any other legendary encounters, like, before the Elite Four. So anyways, now we can actually go this way. He notices us, and I didn't heal up. Oh, crap, because I got in a few battles along the way. Don't worry, nothing died. And I forgot to heal up, so that's really crap. I'm cut above the grumps you've seen so far. I'm not stalling for time. I'm going to pulverize you. Yeah, sure, totally. I believe you. Without a doubt, bro. Oh my god, dude, it's the, it's the guy who's like, hug me. I'll hug you any day. You're just adorable. I love you. All right. I don't think Beast can switch in on a hit, so let's go with Vin's. Okay, he's going for Combine, which is good, because we can just rock slide and hopefully squish the little bat. I still expect to get some for my, for my birthday. You guys better not let me down there. Like, seriously. Uh, Politoed. Ooh. Let's flip it. And we can um, try bullet seating because I don't think Politoed will be able to hit us. Unless he goes for Parish Song, which would really suck. Or Hypnosis would also really suck. I don't want to be put to sleep. Especially like with how my luck with hacks is. Alright, he might as well just waste a turn on Signal Beam. Alright. Really? You really? You have a full restore? I, I should have assumed. I mean, every scientist. I knew it! I knew you were gonna use Paris Song! Oh my god, stop it! Stop it! It's so rude! Okay, we got two more turns so we, to kill this thing. Uh, we gotta switch. If we don't kill it, we're dead. Christopher. But he get. Oh, dude, he's just as smart! What? I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> you never see the. Wow, man, the AR is the AI is so smart in this game. I just, I gotta give him credit. That's kind of impressive. And um, wow, Kingdra, you maybe want to stop doing that would be awesome. You're gonna protect, aren't you? Okay, no, you use Metal Call, which I does Dragon resist steel? I don't know. I know at least times two resist it. I might quad resist it. And just to finish off this rivalry, let's let Felipe finish off Polytoad. And maybe okay, as you say, if we only hit it twice, I'm gonna be so sad. Awesome. Hehehe, <laughs> while I was trying, I was toying with you, our boss got through his preparations. Oh no, the boot! The boot! Hehe, <laughs> our boss has already gone on his way to some cave under the sea. If you're going to give a chase, you'd better, you better search the big white sea beyond Pule. There's a sea by Pule? I wasn't even paying attention. But you'll, but will you find it then? Hehe, <laughs> stay here happy, you meddlesome kid. Hehe, <laughs> you can surf, but can you dive? Dive to the underwater, it's not like you can surf on the sea. Hehe, <laughs> goodbye. Whoa, wait, what the- what? What? <laughs> oh my god, he's a fish! Hi, Hardy! Wait, who's Martin? Have I met you before? I don't remember. Team Aqua has a hideout here! Not as an acceptable, I'll send up a- I kind of already did. Do you want to chase them? Why did you have to get to hit a machine die first? If you don't have it yet, you can find one in Dark Cave, I think! I have to talk to the curator right now, bye! Okay, where in the world is Dark Cave? I don't- Oh crap, what? Oh, hello, Hardy. It's our guy. Can you hear me? The submarine is going to the sea and route you. 
I'll tell Sky to the other people you should pursue them. The weather isn't good there. Be careful. Oh, uh, thanks. Okay, where in this world, where in the world is, oh, crap. Where in the world is Dark Cave? Should I just take a look at our Pokedown because I don't remember seeing that. Dark Cave, um, yeah, like, seriously? Where's Route U <laughs> also? Um, I don't know that either. Route U, I'm assuming, is, okay, that's V, then, shouldn't Route U be right in here? Route U's, uh, Y, X, well, yeah, what, what the heck? It just, it skips U. <laughs> Like, isn't it supposed to be like Q? Oh, I don't know where W, X, R, Y, S, R. Where's, where's, is U over here? L, U. Why are you so difficult? Why are you so difficult? <laughs> um, is it over here? No, nope, these are just letters. Does Route U even exist? Okay, that's Q, A, L. Um, I'm starting to have doubts of my own existence. Okay, that's R, S. T, uh, okay, it's not T. Oh, is that U? Oh, I thought that was V. Okay, so this must be Route U. So, we forgot to find Dark Cave first. Because apparently that's where we get, um, that's where we get Dive. Um, so, where in the world is Dark Cave? Nobody freaking knows. So, apparently we just, we don't go to Dark Cave. It doesn't exist. It, it just, it's no more. But, before we do that, we have to go put our Fallen Canada in the box. And we're kind of running out of Pokemon to bring- Oh, actually, I was going to say we're running out of Pokemon to bring along with us, but I forgot we had four new catches between this episode and the last one. So, you know what? Maybe, um, it's okay. Wow, I'm going to need another Hellbox soon. Yeah. <laughs> um, we should definitely- I kind of want to bring- Well, I don't know if I want three water types, but I'm probably going to have to make someone my Surf and Waterfall bitch. And I don't know if I could catch any more. I could probably catch a Pokemon in the underwater- so, do I want to bring a Neon, a Neo, or Apricorn? Let's see, you have Charge, stru uh, Spark, Self-Destruct, and Rollout, and Aneo uh, has Charge, Thunder Shock, Thunder Wave, and Swagger. Um, one good thing about Phantom is we'd have a Ground-type backup for Electric-types. Once he evolves, anyways, which will be one level. And, well, what, is, what does Grind have? He has... Nothing. Okay, that's awesome. You're level 36 and you have three moves. Uh, you know what? I'm going to leave this up to you guys. Who should my sixth party member be? Or should I potentially replace someone else on my team? You guys can tell me about down below. The last time, the first one to face camp, we got over two... I think we got like 200 likes and over 200 comments. So I know you guys are watching this. You have the ability to click like and to comment. So you guys have set a new standard for yourself. I expect it to be just as good this time. Or I'm going to... I'm gonna pinch your nose just like that. You aren't gonna like it because it hurts. It does. So until next time, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button down below. Very much appreciated. Or dislike if you didn't like it. Don't do that, please. And until next time, I'm Marty Tech Yo Yo. Peace!